For joining us for WCPO 9 News, I'm Brett Bogansky. He is one of the two people who died in a car crash more than two weeks ago in North College Hill. And hours ago, friends and family said goodbye to William Dunson. It is the same crash that killed a Springfield Township police officer. In WCPO 9, senior reporter Sean Delancey was there. He's now live in the studio. And Sean, you heard quite a few messages from those who knew him best. Yeah, I've read dozens and dozens of people poured into the Greater Emmanuel Apostolic Temple to say their final goodbye to what many called a great man and a pillar of the North College Hill community. Dunson was killed in a crash in Springfield Township March 31st when Springfield Township officer Timothy Unwin lost control of his patrol car while responding to an officer in need of assistance call just after midnight. Dunson's lifelong friend Stevie Bester says that he had the biggest smile, the biggest laugh, and was always there for people in need. Outside of his funeral this afternoon, a teacher who educated one of Dunson's four kids remembered him as a man who led by example, teaching his children how to speak with of others, accept criticism, and be respectful to others. I just had to come out here and just show my appreciation for them and um, my sympathy because I can only imagine what they're going through and offer any support to a manual as he travels this journey of losing his best friend, his dad. Officer Unwin was also killed in that crash. Hundreds of officers from around the tri-state attended his funeral late last week, and a procession led his body to the final resting place at Arlington Memorial Gardens. The Springfield Township Police Department is still investigating exactly what led up to that crash that took two lives. In the studio, I'm Sean Delancey, WCPO 9 News.